Yeah. Now this sound reverberates through the entire car and is audible outside of the car too, which kind of makes it feel less like a Mercedes and more like a not Mercedes. I have a suspicion as to what is causing my horrendous groaning noise. This guy, the steering idler arm bushing things, I replaced all of my steering components back. It's been a few years now. It's been a lot of years now. Um, and I didn't do this one right when I did all that stuff. And I did replace this maybe a year or two ago because I wanted to finish the half-complete project. Doesn't sound like me at all. Uh, and so I bought Lemforder parts. I've always loved Lemforder suspension parts. They're an OEM manufacturer for Mercedes, from my understanding, and I have had nothing but great quality. Well, lo and behold, a few months later, my steering starts going every time you steer, and it seems to be coming from this thing. So I did some reading online, and it turns out that the Lemforder bushing thingies are machined slightly too small, and so it pinches and binds up when you tighten the bolt down. And so I bought this Febby Bilstein. Phoebe? Phoebe? Febby? I bought one of these. Different brand. And we're going to put this thing in and see if my car stops making horrible pain sounds. All right. So this right here is what we're looking at. And you can see I've tried adding washers and spacers and even greasing it. And it hasn't slowed down. It's horrendous grown. So let's get some sockets on here and get this thing out. That's actually working. That, that's pulling it out. Right there. <laughs> yep, and see, I tried a little thing in there, and clearly that hasn't, that's, that just dissolved. This is a little aluminum spacer. I thought it would help. It didn't. Didn't help at all. Huh. Okay. Now let's drive the upper one out. I want to be very scientific about this. People said that the issue with this was the measurement of this part of the frame had some variance in it. So see, mine is 83 millimeters, basically on the nose, pretty much 82.95, 83, uh, that's 83 millimeters. So I've got my old ones here. I'm just going to measure those held together like that. What we have here is... 82.28. This is just going to be pinching on these. Let's check our new ones. See what it is. Look at that. 83 on the nose. That's exactly what our measurement was of our uh, piece on the frame. So, there you have it. Scientifically, this should work. Okay. So first thing we're going to do is get these and press them into here. Now, 
seen a number of different ways to do this. I've heard works quite effectively. Just put the old bolt through and kind of get it started. And then we might be able to get that one and get our nut. Ninety point eight. That'll work. Well, there we have it. I've got that new steering idler arm bushing kit put in there and my steering groan is gone. And we saw why too, because of the length of that bushing and how it stacks up next to the length of the piece in the frame. Hopefully that has proved useful to you if you've got a steering groan in your Mercedes or if you're getting ready to put a kit on, measure your frame and measure your new parts because uh, parts are not all made the same, it appears. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching.